Example 5. Determine Cartesian equation of a plane whose equation in vector form is r equals to 1, 2, minus 1 plus s times 1, 0, 2 plus t times 1, minus 1, 0. Correct. So to find Cartesian equation, we need two things. One, a point. Second thing is the normal. How am I going to get the normal? Cross product of these two direction vectors, right? So let's do cross product of 1, 0, 2 and 1, minus 1, 0, right? So let's use the vector method, the matrix method, I, J and K. And we have 1, 0, 2, 1, minus 1, 0. So we can write this as I times 0 minus 2 times minus 1 is minus 2. It becomes plus 0 minus J times 1 times 0, 0 minus 1 times 2 is 2 plus K times 1 times 1 minus 1 is minus 1 minus 0 which gives us I times 2 right so let me write 2i and here is minus 2 so plus 2j and here is minus 1 so minus k these are unit vectors along x y z direction so we get a normal right since we get a normal which is which is 2 2 and minus 1 we could write the vector equation the cartesian equation which is ax plus by plus c z plus d equals to 0 as a is 2, right? So we get 2x plus 2y minus z plus d equals to 0. Now to find d, what are we going to do? We'll use the point 1, 2, minus 1. So we'll use 1, 2, minus 1, correct? So let's do it this way. So if I wrote 1 here, then 2 times 1 is 2 plus 2 times 2 is 4, minus 1 times minus 1 is plus 1, plus d equals to 0. So from here, we get what? 2 plus 4, 6 plus 1, 7, right? So d is equals to minus 7, correct? So since d is minus 7, we can plug it here and get this equation of our plane, right? Therefore, the scalar equation or the Cartesian equation, the scalar equation is the other name for it, the same thing, right, will be 2x plus 2y minus z minus 7 equals to 0. Correct? So that's our solution, okay?